Welcome to VTN.com. I'm Ina Smith alongside Tom Deanhart here in Indianapolis for the Big Ten Championship. On both teams, Penn State and Wisconsin, some staff changes. Penn State, they have a new offensive coordinator and defensive coordinator. How do you think that affected their season? It was huge. I tell you what, this was a big year for James Franklin coming in. 2016, I mean, he was only 14 and 12 overall. People wanted to see some progress. All of a sudden, he's got to replace both his coordinators. No problem for Frank, and I tell you what, goes out and hires Joe Moorhead from Fordham. He remade this Penn State offense, installed the spread, made Trace Victoria the quarterback, and this has been one of the most prolific attacks in the Big Ten. Defensively, lost Bob Shoup to Tennessee. That was considered a huge blow. One of the best DCs in the Big Ten last year. What's James Franklin do? Promotes Brent Pry, the linebackers coach, the defensive coordinator. Pry has done a great job on that side of the ball. Here we are, Amina, in Indianapolis. <laughs> Penn State's going to play for the Big Ten Championship. And Wisconsin, they lost their defensive coordinator to the SEC as well. Did that even affect them this season at all? Yeah, incredible, isn't it? Dave Aranda left Madison for LSU after last year. A lot of people thought he was the best defensive coordinator in the conference last year. How was Wisconsin going to survive Aranda's defection to the SEC? No problem. Paul Christ hires Justin Wilcox, who was at USC. Wilcox didn't make many changes, kept the 3-4 scheme. But like you said, Amina, there's been absolutely no drop-off in Wisconsin's defensive play this year. And like Penn State, they are sort of a surprise team in Indianapolis. And a big reason for that is because of the work of Justin Wilcox. Well, if you guys want to see more highlights, analysis, videos, and more, just head to btn.com slash videos.